Hi, my name is Shada Watts with the YBM Daily, and I have the amazing, talented Tyler Leslie. How are you? I'm doing well. How are you feeling? I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. So I just want to jump right into it, and let's talk about, like, the culture of Harlem and Black representation. Like, how do you feel about that? It's, um, you know, it's something that's, uh, it's just, it's so necessary. It's necessary to feel as an individual. It's necessary to, uh, you know, show and display as an artist. It's necessary to consume and watch as a viewer. And it's uh, it's something that I take great pride in, you know, as 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 black people, and you know, having the pride that we have, but but uh, you know, specifically also being being a voice for this culture in Harlem, which is just very specific. It's rich in culture, and it's it's continuing to be gentrified daily. You know what I'm saying? So we got to fight for what we still got. We got to we got to keep it here. So it's just been my uh, it's been uh, an absolute treat to be able to be a voice for that. Yeah, I love that. Okay. <laughs> Um, I want to talk a little bit about your character, Ian, um, about, like, how does Tyler bring Ian to life? Like, what was the preparation for that like? Um, I would say the first thing I got, uh, the first thing I wanted to get grounded in was just the circumstances. You know, I really empathize with being a, um, you know, you, 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 you know, individuals may view me as one way, but, but truly I'm this, uh, you know, I'm this, I'm this man that's like a lot of us. You know, I'm in process day by day trying to figure out who I am. And, you know what I'm saying, like, what I stand for in life. And, like, that's one thing that, you know, I bring into who Ian is. You know, um, you know he's got this passion. He's, it's, he's, he's following it, even if it's against everything that he's ever known, right? He leaves Harlem, goes over to Paris because he's trying to chase a passion. And uh, he's not trying to settle. I was, I was very, very similar. You know, just 12 years ago, you know, I graduated college. I had a little, you know, I had a little job. I could have settled right there in, in Philly. But something else was calling me, even though I had no idea what I was going to go do. Didn't think I was going to act. I just knew that something, I, I'm leaving here and I'm going there and I don't care if nobody's with me, this is what I'm doing. You know, because I'm trying to figure it out. And it's like, you know, it ended up taking me where I'm at right now and I'll do the same thing in the next chapter, in the next chapter. And it's like, that's what I brought into who Ian is, because I feel like he's on a similar, similar journey. All right. Okay. And so, do you want to leave the fans or viewers with any inspirational message, or like, what does yes. Harlem mean to you? Um, <clears throat> so, I will say, uh, what Harlem means to me is um, that we got to fight for, um, you know, what we believe in and what we take pride in. You know, it's uh, even if it's a small little coffee shop, if it's a small little block, it could be as big or as small as whatever it is. You know, if if our heart is in it, we got to fight for it. Could be, uh, you know, could be Harlem as a whole. Could be a relationship. You know, whatever it is, we got to put it on the line and go after it. And uh, you know, I'll leave y'all with this. Um, you know, a ship is safest at the shore, but that's not what a ship is built for, right? It's built to go deep and go get it. You know what I'm saying? We got to go get it to bring it back. It's not about staying on the sideline and settling. So it's like, um, you know, that's what I would like to leave y'all with. You know, we got to go after and get it and protect what's ours. I like that message. Thank you so much, Tyler. I appreciate it. Oh, pleasure was mine. Thanks.